Hey guys, welcome to Barbecue with Jeff. In the video series, How to Barbecue Like a Boss. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to light your charcoal barbecue using a charcoal chimney. A lot of people like to use newspaper to light their charcoal chimneys. I much prefer to use the Weber fire starters, but you might not have access, so here's how you would use the newspaper. First, take a piece of newspaper and roll it up loosely. You don't want to roll it too tight. If you do, uh, there won't be very much oxygen in between the pieces of paper, and it won't burn very good. So take it and form it into like a donut, and then lay it down in the bottom of your charcoal chimney, like so. And then take a couple of pieces of newspaper and, and crumple it up loosely to kind of give you a little bit extra fuel there when you go to light your go to light your charcoal chimney. Next, I'm going to show you why I do not like to use newspaper. All right, so the fire's going really well. This does actually light your charcoal really good and really quickly, but uh, as you can see, there's all kinds of newspaper ash and soot coming up from the top of that chimney. It stays in the barbecue no matter what you do. And it just really makes a mess, and I don't know about you, but I don't want that on my food. So instead, I, I like to use the Weber, uh, Weber charcoal starters. Okay, so these are the Weber brand charcoal starters that I like to use. Uh, according to the packaging, they're non-toxic, uh, odorless, and uh, can start when wet. Uh, they're made of basically paraffin wax, and it's an overall great product, works every time. Highly recommend it. Okay, so I've got my uh, charcoal chimney filled with Kingsford blue bag charcoal. Plop down the uh, lighter cube, light it on fire, throw the chimney on top, and it's really just that simple. Uh, I'm going to start a timer here now, so you guys see just how long it takes to get this uh, load of charcoal lit and ready. So it's been 16 minutes, and as you can see, this uh, load of charcoal is ready to cook on. It's ashed over on top, and you can see the bit of orange fire. Um, I recommend that you use a pair of fire resistant gloves. I use a pair of welder's gloves when you're use, when you're handling your charcoal chimney. Uh, the charcoal inside could be five, six hundred degrees, so safety first. Uh, as you can see, the charcoal chimney has a second handle here. It makes it really easy to uh, dump out and uh, put the charcoal exactly where you want it. Uh, very handy, and that's why I recommend the Weber brand charcoal chimney over anything else I've seen at least. Uh, so there you have it folks, uh, you got your charcoal ready to cook on in about 16 minutes, and that's all it takes. Uh, that's all it is for this video folks, hope you liked it. Please uh, slap that like button, and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. We're going to have a lot of great uh, videos coming up over the next few weeks in the Barbecue Like a Boss series. going to show you how to do ribs, and how to do pulled pork, chicken, all on the Weber kettle. Uh, if you haven't already, hit, uh, hit up the website at bbqwithjeff.com and uh, feel free to leave, leave a comment there, leave some feedback. Uh, look forward to hearing from all of you guys.